Now, your weather alert forecast. It's been a warm start to the month of November, and it looks like that trend is going to carry over even into the weekend. Our afternoon high temperatures will be climbing into the low 70s area wide across Nebraska, even into Iowa, down to the south of Missouri and Kansas. So if you do have any travel plans this weekend, looks like some terrific weather conditions. Pinpointing some of those numbers for you as we go into the afternoon, we're looking at a high of about 73 in Wayne, mostly sunny skies. Our winds will be very light from the southwest at five miles an hour. Just the wind direction enough to help to pump in some warm air across the area and again lasting into the weekend. 72 in Elkhorn, 74 in Lincoln, a little further south that we go. We're going to be around 71 degrees in Pawnee City and as well as Falls City. In the afternoon, high temps for Red Oak, 72 degrees. Oakland, you're about 71. And even further north into Iowa we go. Denison and Carroll maybe pushing close to 74 degrees. With tons of sunshine across the area, that means that temperatures will remain way above average. Normal high this time of the year, around 56 degrees. But as we go into Sunday, we have some changes. There's a system that's been hanging out of the Four Corners region across Arizona, New Mexico, even Utah and Colorado. That's going to push a little bit more cloud cover our way on Sunday. Looks like the rain will hold off into the central and western part of the state. Cloud cover increasing, though throughout the day on Sunday into early Monday morning, and that's when we could see a better chance for some showers returning to the area. Right now, the rainfall amounts need to be on the light side. Okay, so later tonight, well, we're looking at that time change. So it is that time of year once again where we have to set those clocks back an hour. So that means that before you go to bed, Daylight savings time starts Sunday morning at 2 a.m. So just a reminder, don't forget about your clocks uh, before you go to bed at night. 72 degrees, another warm day on Sunday. Drop it back to about 66 degrees on Monday with a, a chance for some scattered showers across the area. And I think most of the activity occurs uh, before lunchtime may linger into the early afternoon. 67 election day, still a mild day. And it looks like more sunshine returning by Wednesday. Drop it off to 63, right back up again in the upper 60s for Thursday and Veterans Day on Friday. That's when we see a change coming our way. Another front moving in and high temperatures will drop back closer to normal for this time of the year. Even though we don't have any severe weather in the forecast, always a good reminder to download the Storm Shield app so you are prepared.